Hello folks and welcome back to the Panzer. So time to give you guys a quick update on our repairs uh, following our lack of driving talent crash. So in the, the boot here you may remember that the uh, strut mounts were completely bent and busted. So this is the one that I've removed. Uh, that was the least damaged one. Uh, so it bent the entire bar uh, that was going across between the strut towers. So on the back here now, I've replaced all this. Um, that is now 50 by 50 by five millimeter wall, box section steel in there and used heavier section uh, here as well for mounting to the inner subframe. So that's all uh, pretty much back to the way it should be. Uh, surprisingly, both of the shock absorbers didn't get any uh, damage, so I could reuse those. So that's the inside of the damage section has been replaced. So we put uh, the wheels back down. Uh, the left side here is pretty good. There's no issues here at all. Um, so that looks, you know, to be pretty much where it should be. I've just got to, I've got to set the height on the the strut. So it's a bit, um, it's a bit low at the minute there. So I just got to do that. Uh, right side is where we got most of the problems, as you're about to see. Uh, not so good. So our, basically our uh, trailing arm is bent backwards and in. Uh, so that trailing arm is going to need to be replaced. And the good news on that is I sourced one, I've cleaned it up here, painted up. So we have new trailing arm and a wheel bearing uh, to put in here. So we'll be able to get this guy changed out uh, fairly soon. And that will have hopefully our wheel geometry uh, back where it needs to be. So again, got away very lightly here uh, without doubt because um, this is, you know, when you kind of look at that, you see, wow, you know, that's, that's pretty bad, but <clears throat> certainly could have been worse. Now, around the same <clears throat> area here, uh, we got a little bit of damage to that quarter panel, and unfortunately, my rather dodgy rust repair uh, has shown itself up for the hack job that it was. So I'm gonna have to find some way to repair this properly. Anyone has any suggestions, um, then please leave a comment because the one thing that I'm absolutely worse at than track driving is car bodywork. So that I need to fix. Not immediately, but needs to be fixed uh, certainly before we put the car on the road. So that's about where we're at here. Uh, coming up to the front then, obviously, as you guys will have seen in the last video, the nose cone is a complete write-off. Now, this is where we get some very good news because right here, we have an absolutely uh, mint condition nose cone. Uh, this is just paint flex here. There's no cracks or damage, that's just the paint. Um, that is not cracked there. It looks like it, but it's not. That's that's just the paint. Um, got a mint condition nose cone, rear bumper, um, bits and pieces, and side skirts. And I was given these for absolutely free uh, by a gentleman who saw some of my videos on YouTube. So. 
you know who you are and thank you very much indeed because uh, not only would this stuff have been expensive to find, uh, it would have been very difficult to find. So, once we get the car driving with that uh, trailing arm changed out, going to get the nose cone on, uh, get the wheels sorted out, get her own wheels back on. This side's fine. And then the last thing I need to sort out is the electrical gremlin, which has basically knocked out my electric windows on both sides of the car. I've checked the basics, like fuses and relays, doesn't seem to be a problem, so I'm going to have to delve deeper. So, that's where we're going at the minute, folks. A uh, little bit slow progress because I've had other projects going on, but once we get this changed out, I think we should be pretty good. So, Thanks again for tuning in. Thanks for all of the support. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Check the links in the description for my Patreon and PayPal, should you wish to financially support any of this craziness. And also link in the description to my GitHub, where you can download uh, any of the designs that I ha have worked on or I'm currently working on. So, that's it guys, I've got some repair work to do, so until then, happy trailing arm replacement. <laughs>